Welcome back. Now we're stepping into the world of still to walking with Walking Tall Jamaica, celebrating a tradition that has graced Jamaican culture for centuries. Walking Tall Jamaica is dedicated to reviving the and sharing the art of still walking, deeply rooted in maroon heritage. Jamaican maroon and founder of Walking Tall J.A. Simone Harris and still walk handler and assistant Tavia Benjamin join us to tell us about a tradition that has really been a dominant part of our culture. What going, girl? What are you doing? Yo, this, this young lady <laughs> is the real deal. Like, if it's about the culture, she's about it. So yes. it's always great to talk to you on different topics related to Jamaican culture. Tell us about stilt walking and why it is so deeply intertwined in the Jamaican identity. Well, you know, it's deeply intertwined in the Caribbean identity. True. And oftentimes, Jamaica is left out of that picture. I, I agree, yes. Eastern Caribbean, I mean, everywhere, mm -hmm. you have the Mokojombe's giant spirits, mm -hmm. right? And that's actually where I fell in love with it, mm -hmm. before knowing about the maroon connection. Mm -hmm. um, and that my father, as a child, a maroon boy, mm -hmm. this is what he would have done for fun, yes. as entertainment, yeah. you know? So I was in Trinidad in 2016, and that was my first interaction, my first encounter with mm -hmm. the spectacle mm -hmm. of Moko Jumbies. Uh, Jamaica does uh, still walking in a slightly different way, presentation-wise. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. In Trinidad, it, it was really inspiring for me. Mm. And so three years later, came back to Jamaica. I was fortunate to receive a grant from the British Council mm -hmm. to run a, an arts program. And I had the option to choose whatever art form. Mm. And I decided I wanted to learn stilt walking and I wanted other young Jamaicans to learn how to do this as well. Mm. So, so tell me about it, because you said, I mean, we've done it for fun in previous generations. I mean, I've read where actually stilt walking in some cultures, it stems from actually it's a survival strategy. It's um, you know, it's a response to environment because culture is a response to environment. Yes. Uh, 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 in so many ways, like, where are some of the places in Jamaica where this is actually an art form that you know is very rich? So I definitely know about Portland, mm -hmm. Saint Thomas, and since we've been practicing, we we tend to occupy public spaces, of yeah, course, yeah. right? Yeah. And people will come up to us all the time. Oh, I used to do this when I was young in St. Anne. Oh. Uh, just earlier this week, we mm -hmm. met someone who is from Spanish Town who mm -hmm. said in the 70s, mm. he used to do it as a boy. Um, I just met a co-worker who explained to me that in St. Thomas growing up, mm -hmm. she would see other kids doing this thing, silt really? walking. Yeah, so all over Jamaica, mm. there is this history of silt walking, but mm -hmm. it's something that if we're not careful, it's going to be lost to time. Mm. So, so, so Walking Tall JA now as an initiative, you say you've gotten some funding. I mean, what is it that you actually do? Are you like you, you are open up to people who want to learn? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. We teach people how to still walk. Mm -hmm. um, you'll see Akeem later, yeah. Grim Skywalker. He learned to walk with us. But it's not just about learning to walk on stilts. Mm -hmm. It's about our three C's. Mm -hmm. Culture, connection, and community. Aye. So we're building the individual, mm -hmm. you know, inside. It's a, it's a, as an activity, it's something that transforms you, mm -hmm. to be honest. And while you're going the three C's? Why the three C's? Why you have to include it into the, into the still walking? Like, I mean, I want you to share it. I understand it. Because yeah. if you understand you, then yeah. you know why. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but tell for the people who don't. I mean, it, it's still walking as an activity. It is a community activity. Mm -hmm. In the Eastern Caribbean, a lot of, in lot, a lot of spaces where you mm -hmm. find it present, it's uh, an intervention strategy mm. it's um, after school activity mm -hmm. um, for children a yeah. lot of young people are into stilt walking mm -hmm. um, it keeps them occupied it keeps them busy it also is a way of generating income for them right and mm. it's a part of you're a part of a family when yeah. you're learning to walk on stilts so that's our community you're building connections with other people mm -hmm. you're meeting new people and also you're exploring your culture not only as a jamaican mm -hmm. but also as a caribbean a citizen of the caribbean mm. so definitely. that's why the three <laughs> <laughs> I, I, and I, I i can definitely appreciate that like 
Pe uh, okay, I was just, <laughs> I was just about to ask. Yeah. So when the people ever learn, them not drop like me yes. afraid, me big afraid. Yeah. But like, uh, I mean, in terms of teaching them, how, is there a graduation in height of the stilts and this? Yes. Like. We're going to see somebody very tall up into yes. the sky. Yes. I mean, <laughs> yes. Yes. I mean, they never go up here. <laughs> but, like, how do you I I I um, initiate them into right. it? Right. I know, you know, we'll see images of um, a lot of Trini, Trini stilt walkers, mm. high up doing all these tricks. What we don't understand is all of them start on one foot tall stilts. And you'll see, the, see that this morning. Mm -hmm. So we all start on one. Originally, we all started on two feet. We're overachievers. Mm -hmm. um, so many of our walkers in Walking Tall have experience on two feet. Yes. And, but now, once you come to learn to walk with us, we take you down to one foot. Then you go up one and a half, then to two. So you control that fear mm -hmm. that you're going to fall yeah. because it's a gradual increase. Yeah. And also, did you know that walking is the art of falling? We have evolved to know that you have to put the next foot forward so that you don't fall. I never thought of it we that way. We are walking way. tall. Yeah. I never <laughs> thought of it that way. And when you put it that way, it makes it easier to, 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 to develop mastery. And the truth is that, you know, I was just saying it this week in a, in a different capacity, that you have to be able to get over that initial period of awkwardness where everything is concerned Absolutely. in order to develop mastery at anything. And so... When you come to Walking Tall, mm -hmm. that is it. The skill that you learn us, you mm -hmm. can translate them into life. Um, so you're on Instagram. Um, people can have a look. You can feel it out. They can send you a DM. Tell yes. us where people can find you. Walking Tall J A mm -hmm. on Instagram. Walking Tall J A on Instagram. Um, if definitely. you're not on Instagram, yeah. um, I can be reached by a phone. Mm -hmm. 876 mm -hmm. 379 8480. And I have to just add, mm -hmm. this past summer, I was fortunate to be the first Jamaican to be a part of an artist residency with the cultural icon in Trinidad and Tobago, mm -hmm. Junior Biznat mm -hmm. of Kaisoka Mokos. Yes. He's a master wood artist, mm -hmm. not just a carpenter, mm -hmm. wood artist. Mm -hmm. So he has trained the best mm -hmm. stilt walkers out of Trinidad nice. and Tobago. And I had the opportunity to spend a week mm -hmm. understudying, learning how to make stilts, understanding what it means to build community using stilt walking. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love the thing. <laughs> you always you always get this effect from me. <laughs> Thank you very much, Simone. Harris, Jamaican Maroon. You'll always be Jago girl. Ah! <laughs> Jamaican Maroon and founder of Walking Tall J.A. On the other side of the break, <laughs> it's due to, oh, she don't afraid of nothing. Yen Dizzle will be learning to walk tall. And we are joined, of course, by Walking Tall team from Yadis Got Talent. There's more sunrise. Tall up, tall up after this.